Hey everyone, it's Sadie. Um, in this video, I'll be showing you how I do this peachy, dewy, glossier, everyday, summer, literally like 50 names for this look, makeup look. <laughs> um, I recently bought a lot of glossier products because I got a gift card for Christmas and I splurged. So, um, yeah, this is kind of the look that I do every day. I just, I use different products. I typically don't use 98% Glossier, but I decided to try it all out and um, all the products are listed in the description box below and let me know if you guys have any questions. So let's get started. So, yeah, I'm just taking my primer, the same one I used in my New Year's video. But yeah, so normally I can't afford Glossier by myself, but I got a gift card for Christmas, so I got all this new stuff. Thank God. Um, I religiously use Glossier Lash Slick, which I have been using for a few months, since August, because I went to the LA store in August with my dad, and I wanted to buy something besides my Milky Jelly that I use every night. I love that product so much. And then I'm just taking a flat brush. I kind of use this as kind of a foundation. I don't wear foundation, but kind of just as a base. Because, like, it just feels really nice. Like, look how dewy my skin is already, and I barely used anything. Most of the questions I get are about my hair, like, when did I cut it? All that stuff. I cut it in... Ooh. 2016, in February. Like, I had been wanting to cut it for a while, and February was, like, the time I could do it. But, yeah. After I cut it off, I was like, yeah, I'm never growing my hair out again. Like, this is... What happens? Yeah. I was going through, like, a transitional phase, and I went through, like, five hair colors in a year. And I found a picture of Michelle Williams one day, and just... Decided I was going to chop all my hair off. Like, literally just a split second decision. I was like, I'm cutting off all my hair. My parents were cool with it. I get a lot of DMs from you guys. Saying your parents aren't cool with you cutting your hair off. But like, it's it's your hair. Like, why why would they care? I don't, I don't, that doesn't make sense to me. My parents are like, well, hair grows back, so. I don't care. But yeah, it just, it doesn't make sense to me when you guys tell me your parents aren't okay with you having short hair. I'm like, why? <laughs> so, I'm gonna take a little bit more concealer and just put it in the spot where it's a little darker. This concealer is amazing. Like, I have dark circles and I'm not even, like, rubbing it. I'm literally just pressing my finger in and... It's, it's amazing. I love this stuff. I think it's worth the price, but the concealer itself isn't that expensive. The highlighter, on the other hand, $20 for this. Like, yeah, it's amazing, but why? Why does it need to be that expensive? It's crazy. Okay, I'm trying to think. What do I do next? Oh, eyebrows. I've actually been watching a lot of Joanna Spicer, and this is <laughs> kind of what this video is, you know, what's the word I'm looking for? Inspired by? I must have sponsored. I was like, yep, sponsored by Joanna Spicer. Because that makes sense. But yeah, I just love her. She's so funny, and I love all of her makeup looks because they're really natural and just pretty. And I just, I feel like we have a similar personality. Like, Glossier is a perfect makeup for you if you like to look like you're sweating because like people that know me know that i am not an outdoorsy person and i hate sweating i hate sweating which is funny because i was a lifeguard for the past two years so i was like suffering i hate warm weather <laughs> But 
like you guys wanted a vlog of like my everyday life and I'm like I'm usually inside doing homework or planning my Instagram or stuff like that I don't don't do anything and I'm just spraying my face before I put my highlighter on and I'm taking my halo scope and quartz I love this but I like I said don't think it's worth $22 probably just saying that because I genuinely cannot afford it unless I had a gift card that's why I asked for a gift card because I really wanted to try this product and I was like I literally just need money so I can buy this this is just like my favorite makeup product my makeup brand, not product. I've been to both of their flagship stores, the one in LA recent, most recently, and also the one in New York. I accidentally stumbled into the one in New York. Like, it was really funny. <laughs> he just looked up and was like, that's a Glossier, what? Man, this highlighter just makes me look like I'm sweating. Like, look, look, look at, I love it. Okay. And then I'm using my cloud paint. I almost called it Halo Scope again, and I was like, no, it's not the right word. Cloud paint and dusk. This is like a really perfect peachy nude color. I don't know if you guys know this, but I love peach. Peach tones. I love this blush. It's so natural. And I typically don't wear bronzer when I wear this because it's kind of bronzy too. Um, another question y'all ask me all the time is how I got into Instagram. When I started my Instagram in... When did I first start it? I didn't get one until 2016, but I only got it because everyone had it and they were like, you need an Instagram, and I was like, I don't have a life, but okay. <laughs> so since I didn't really have a life or anything that I was doing, I just kind of started, you know, doing the aesthetic posts, I guess you could say. That and I just really enjoyed doing it. I thought it was super fun. So, yeah, I just started doing that. And then a page for short hair found one of my pictures and reshared it, and my Instagram like blew up. And ever since then, I've been like, you know, confused but into it. I'm taking my lash slick, like I said, my absolute favorite mascara. Like every time I wear this mascara, you guys ask me if I've gotten lash extensions and I'm like, nope, it's literally just this mascara. Like I love it so much. Like, look at the difference. It's crazy. This concealer is supposed to be like crease proof, but it my my so my under eyes still crease because that's just how my under eyes are. Because my eyes are so huge, there's a lot of skin under there, so always creasing. And I have to get the excess off my mouth. I can't. I hate watching YouTubers or like makeup artists put liquid lipstick on their dry, crusty lips that are covered in foundation. That is like the worst thing to watch to me. Oh my gosh. It's so gross. I don't... How do they... How? How can they stand it? I always have to have like some kind of moisture on my lips. I can't... It's gross. And then I'm taking my Generation G in Cake. This is like the perfect peachy nude. I like peachy shades, okay? Sorry. And I'm actually going to take some lip gloss that is not glossy lip gloss. I got this. I don't know where I got this. Okay, I think that's it. Yeah. Okay. Well, that is my 
everyday slash glossier slash dewy makeup look. <laughs> I was like, how many names did I have for this? A lot. Um, but yeah, it's really refreshing and it feels really good on my face. I feel like I'm not wearing anything. It's really natural. It's just something that enhances your natural beauty and that's why I love Glossier products. Yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this and I'll have to do like a Q&A video or something where you guys like send me questions and stuff. But yeah, let me know what you guys would like to see next in the comments below and um, I actually have a 10% off coupon for you guys in the description box for Glossier. Um, it's just a link that will, when you open it, you can just shop through it and it'll automatically be applied at checkout. So it's not 20% because I'm not a rep, but it's, you still get a discount. It's pretty sweet. So. so let me know if you guys have any questions and make sure you subscribe and hit the like button. Oh, I sound like just a stereotypical YouTuber. It's weird. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this and I will see you in the next video.